Okay. How you doing? Let's interview Wiggle for us as much as we hate her. I'm no stranger to interviews, darling. Hit me with your best shot. Like 30, like either like 30 or 20 more minutes. <laughs> All right. Who are you? And why are you on this planet? You've certainly heard my number one single, Do the Wiggle. I had that stuck in my head for a solid month. Well, I mean, Gramble, you see, Wiggle Wigglebottom needs no introduction. Gramble's like a uh, person that we don't necessarily all hate. <laughs> uh, why come to Active Island? Well, I'm here to gorge myself on a new life experience. To get my creative juices flowing, as it were. Uh, so your juice isn't flowing? Oh, well. What do you mean it's just like Gramble? You know, no hit can stay on top forever. And I'm afraid the audience didn't care for Wiggle's World or Wiggle Baby one more time. And I've been accused of being a one-hit Wiggle. A one-hit Wiggle? Uh, at least it's more acceptable than anybody else. Thoughts and post Every taste is like a star going supernova inside my mouth. Creative energy like I've never felt before. Bug snacks are worth whatever price I have to pay, darling. Aw, what price is that exactly? Bug snacks are forbidden fruits, darling. I believe something exists to keep us from. Let's turn Beth Gun into a monstrosity. One day. Yes, we should. But not before I dazzle the world once more. I've heard that she turns into nightmare fuel if you turn her into a pickle. <laughs> That's simple. I was following Gramble. He certainly knows his way around snacks. Uh, are you using Gramble for a soup fly? No! Goodness, no! I love Gramble. I would never. He's far too sweet. Like a little strabby. No, I would never take advantage of him, no matter how easy it would be. Hmm. I am phone Lisbert. Ah, oh, Lisbert. She and Egabel were big fans of mine. You know, I met them backstage at my first farewell tour. Aww. They didn't have passes, mind you. Liz climbed in through the air ducts. But if somebody breaks the law out of love for my music, who am I to turn them away? Aww. Does this happen a lot? Not nearly as often as I'd like. Uh, what happened to Lizbert? <gasps> that night, <clears throat> when Liz went missing, I ran into the woods looking for her. But instead, I found something terrifying. Towering over the trees. <laughs> The queen of bug snacks. Her screech was deafening, and I ran for my life. The queen of bug snacks? What is this queen of bug snacks thing? Well, I can't be sure. All I saw was a menacing silhouette. But if Liz crossed paths with that, that thing, then I fear for her. I fear no man. That thing. It scares me. Thanks, Michael. That's a wrap. Ah, I feel the warm glow. She was high that night. Publicity. I know my story about the queen sounds far fetched, but I swear on my platinum <laughs> record, it's true. If you don't believe me, go and see for yourself. Oh boy. Now. If you'll excuse me, I've got music to make. Speedball. So she gave me a map or something, but that's not looks like a place I've been to already. What's going on? Oh, bestie! I was just looking for you. Now that Wiggle's hey. back, Snacksburg is finally <laughs> interesting again. I'm in the mood for some snacking and snooping. But like... <laughs> but they trust you, right, Bestie? Uh, so here's what I'm thinking. You dig up dirt on Wiggle and share it with me. And maybe I'll tell you something good in return. I 
guess. Oh. What do you want, Wiggle? Need something? If you're not busy, darling, I could use a helping paw. It seems like your run-of-the-mill bug snacks aren't getting my creative juices flowing. I need something, oh, spectacular. I overheard Wambus talking about a sando pea. A sando what? A snack made of many pieces working in... <laughs> Who the fuck runs these electrons? <laughs> that may be just <laughs> what I need. Uh, oh, yellow submarine, I get it. Beatles joke. <laughs> Yeah, what do you Evening. want? What do you want, Wambus? You need help. Howdy, stranger. I could use your help with something. See, nobody's figured out how bug snacks reproduce. Oh. But I got an idea. Oh, I think I might be able to garden them. Grow, some grow them in the dirt, like plants. How'd, they, how'd you come by that theory? Well, half of them look like fruit, but I reckon there's more to it than that. I've seen bug snacks crawl out of the dirt that weren't there before, fresh and gooey like. Seems promising to me. Mm. All I need to start off is a root and a fruit. Should be simple enough. A root and a fruit. A root and a fruit. And a fruit and a root. And a root fruit. And a fruit root. And a root and a fruit and tooty woody. <laughs> Loop. <laughs> okay. So now that I have a thing that I wanted to get. Let me do this. Launch pad. Launch. Well, I missed my long shot. Okay. Oh, it's gonna hit a tree. Hang on. Ah! Get the launch pad. Wait, what's down there? What are you? Dr. Sody? Dr. Sody! I love you! I want a Dr. Sody. Dr. Sodium, have a woman. Come here! Come here, buddy! Get out of the way, Bunker! Sodi! Sodi? Aww. What are you? Crispy snack pod. Yeah, they go under. To, they go under mitosis. <laughs> right. So we need to look for a root and a root. I, I guess we can get another like uh, white strappy. What the fuck was that? What was that? Crop hopper. Ah, it's a corn. A C corn. Okay, let's go grab a uh, let's go grab a root and a fruit. Well, I mean, we already got a fruit, but we're gonna get a root. What does it say? You get that root. When a mom and a dad, or a mom and a mom, or a dad and a dad love, very, love each other very much, they do a little fancy action and redact it into a cup, and then they combine components in a bowl cup, like a secret lab experiment, and then BOOM! China, a child, and financial stability. And then BOOM! Child, and financial instability. <laughs> So we got a fruit. Now we need a root. You know that. 
The only real answer is that they have a cloak. <laughs> okay. I wonder that we can catch one of these things. Green Wallaf. That was the thing that tried to attack it. What are you? Santa Beam! It's Bunger's final form. Oh. Why is this brutal white? I'm gonna catch it, but why? Some things you just don't want to use it to. White Rizzle? Ah! <laughs> Wait, what is this? Ranch dressing? You need to tell me that there's ranch growing on these trees? What are you? <laughs> Yeah, you should look in the in the chat. No, it's not come. <laughs> well, I'm about to think like ranch. No, come back. Thank you kindly. I'll get those bug snacks growing. You'll see. like a real hoot. Uh, who are you? 
know. I go digging up bits of history and try to piece them back together. It's usually not so dramatic. Just an old coin or a severed toe under a rock. But this island's chock full of finds. Um, and your name? Oh, goodness, my name. I'm Trippity Why come to Sectiv Island? heard about the trip to Snack Tooth and thought, well, I could keep scraping at odds and ends till the day I die. Or I could really get out there. Try following in Grandma's footsteps. Grandma? Who's Grandma? You might have heard of Veronica, lot of log. An adventuring type just like Lisbert. She filled up our old house with relics and sketches, taught me to love history. Bless her heart. Reminds me of my mom. I'm sorry to break it to you. She's dead. <laughs> hey, we're not supposed to know that yet. Lots of bugs next. Amazing, don't you think? We got paintings of bug snacks from a thousand years ago. Grumpus civilization rises, collapses, and turns to dust. But the bug snacks, they always stay. They are walking records of history. Why'd you leave town? It's less I left and more I stopped coming back. I wasn't even there when the fight broke out. Aww. Imagine me coming home to find Wambus all red in the face at Bramble's throat. Uh, and that is why you and Wambus split? No, no, nothing so simple as that. I wanted him to come with me to the ruins, honest. But he wouldn't give up his farm, not even for me. <laughs> Stubborn fool. Any info on Lisbert? Lovely gal, that Lisbert. Wasn't often we'd both be in town at the same time. And when we were, we'd usually be in the medical tent, oh. <laughs> getting treated by Agabelle. We'd swap stories about what we found and show off our grisliest scars. Aww. You two got injured often? Adventuring is a dangerous business. Archaeology less so. But the Ladablog method can be unconventional. Ladablog method? Bug the heck out of Agabelle. She never liked to see anyone hurt. Least of all, Liz. What happened to Liz, Bert? You know, out here, it's only a matter of time before you fall in a hole or get wedged in a crevice. Especially with all these earthquakes shifting the geography around. Mm. Not to be morbid, but it could be a thousand years before somebody finds where Lisbert wound up. Uh, thanks, Trifony. I learned a lot. Oh, you're too kind. I'm just happy to chip in and solve a mystery or two. Speaking of mysteries... Yeah, something for me? You betcha! Lisbert stashed a journal in the ruins for safekeeping. Oh. I can't get it open without damaging whatever's inside. I'm Don't thinking be. you might have better luck with it. Anywho, I've nearly talked your ear off. Better get back to work, eh? Yeah. Has a watch journal? I need a key. I have an exact key! This is not on your code. Check your journal for details. Hold on, take it. Alright, let me go over here real quick. Looks like I need to weigh down some pressure points in order. First, left. Or should I cross up there? And then this. Door is attached to some ancient mechanisms. It looks like at least three grumpus is connected to these. And then this is. Oh, this is in Sugar Pine Woods. Okay. Let's see. Where is. Okay, let's go talk to you. You got that party look again. Snacksburg is looking pretty busy tonight. Seems like Maybe a great time no to ass. gather everybody around the old campfire. Uh, let's do it. Now there is a bit of a secret that happens over here, and Uh nothing like a campfire, eh, buddies? What the fuck was that? Dark. Nothing like a camp. I tell you, there's some spooky stuff out there. You saw that, right? <laughs> There ain't nothing out there, just bug snacks and trees. You didn't see that behind that? Yellow? Um, 
pink. There's really something stalking me, watching me from the shadows. Keeps me up at night. I've really? seen no. something similar up on top of the canyon. Real curious. Probably just a wild animal. Darling, there are no animals here. None but we, that is. I, uh, I too saw the thing. Can we talk about something else? You know, the desert grumps, they had some odd rituals. They take their old and dying and seal them in secret caves. Oh. <gasps> Whatever like the for. Egyptian method. Were the dead going to rise from the grave? No, not as such. It's more the bodies would just disappear. What? What? How? What? The writing's kind of vague, sadly. All <laughs> I know is they us. had a rash of vanishing corpses. Long as they were exposed, well, heck, even if they buried them in the sand, the body wouldn't be there the next day. Hmm. Though some of the time, there'd be a little left. Just a few bones. Oh. I'm getting a chill just thinking about it. You're getting a chill because the fire's gone out. No wonder. Oh, you're right. Uh, hey, buddy, would you mind picking up some firewood? It's over by the mill. Uh, I guess? Okay. The mill house. Can we, like, over here? Oh. Get some firewood from the mill. Yeah, I got the firewood. Okay, where were we? Um, uh, Triffany, you were saying something about the zombies? No, no zombies. What is Listen, this? Spooky as the disappearing stiffs may be, that's just a story I read on a wall. I got a stick. We got nothing to fear from the dead. I'm more worried about the living. The living? Obviously, we're not the first Grumpuses to make it to Snacktooth. So what makes us think all the others are dead? We've seen oh, those oh, is that is that swear to God. We all know something kills Grumpuses out there, and it has teeth. Bug snacks don't have teeth. And like Wiggle said, there aren't animals out here other than us. That's true. She's not wrong about the bones. The bones. Ah, ah, uh, time out. I gotta use a little grump drum. Now hold on. You saying Grumpuses turn cannibal? What? That's ridiculous. We ain't got the stomachs for it. Lufty eats Grumpus. What? Ah, no way that's true. Oh, it's true. Late one night, I saw Floofty dragging something along the beach. When I got closer, I saw what it was. A severed leg. When did this game and get so watched, dark? They held it up to their mouth. And then, they took a bite out of it. Uh, don't mess with my head, Beff. You're gonna scare me snackless. <laughs> Oh, Grump! Is somebody gonna check on Philbo? I guess I will. Give me a moment. Check if Philbo's okay in the bathroom. The shit monster? <laughs> Philbo? Oh god, this great mighty poo! Oh, hey, buddy! Uh, sorry, I, uh, I got a little too scared. <laughs> 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 what was that? Huh? I, I, I don't know what you're talking about, buddy. Are you feeling okay? You look like you've seen a ghost. <laughs> <clears throat> well, uh, let's keep it together and get back to the fire. I, I guess. Got my stationary stick. <laughs> Sorry about that. What I miss? Can we just get the spooky stuff? Story? I don't think I could get oh, any sleep. On... Darling, calm yourself. For Why is she turning into reverb all of a sudden? In the shadows. <laughs> it's the queen of bug snacks. A bug snack bigger than any we've ever seen. Scene. Bigger than uh, my own fat ass? Okay, that was probably a little bit too she harsh on myself. Unlocks this delicious orchestra. Bring Can I throw a stick at her? Music to our mouths. As 
and once we're dancing to her tune. She gobbles us up? That's precisely right, darling. This story makes no right. sense. Why would Bug Snacks have a monarchy? Oh, Wambus, it's just a More time. like a hierarchy. I've seen Bug Snacks big enough to eclipse the moon. What else would you call that? Um, a hallucination? Believe what you will, Wambus. For I know what I've seen. Regardless of what sort of monster you believe in, something is lurking out there. And it's only a matter of time before it comes. You're part of other drugs. <laughs> Grumpin' Snacks, it's coming for us. I said she's coming for us! Yeah, yeah, she's gonna get us all. Not a lot of for us, sick of wiggle. We, we, no need to freak out. It's probably just a, uh, uh, something safe. I'm freaking out, Wambus! I'm not getting eaten by some monster or floofty just because you won't admit you're scared. Don't worry, Gramble. We'll go check it out. Oh, boy. If something goes wrong, sacrifice Philbo first. Sacrifice. I'll just throw the stick over there for right now. Holy shit. <laughs> She's a drug addict. <laughs> what carnation are you? Hey, uh, Chandlo? Whoa, it's Philbo. And somebody new? Hey, how are you? Doing better these days? Hey. Yeah, uh, Snacksburg is coming back together. I noticed. I saw the fire and I thought, whoa, Snacksburg's on fire. It's so on fire. So I came fire. down here to check on it. <laughs> then I remembered I left some stuff at the mill, so here I am. Is Shelda around? What the fuck is a Shelda? Oh, no. Nobody's seen Shelda since the, uh, the, the fight. Major bummer, bro. I could use her wisdom right now. Anyway, can't stay and hang. I gotta get all this stuff back to Snorpy right away. Snorpy? You know how he gets. Don't you at least want to say hi to everybody? Uh, if I do that, they're gonna want me to stay. Ed Get you later, He's high on edibles. But, but I do want you to stay. Oh, darn it. Oh, well. Let's get back and tell the others. Well, at least it wasn't a ghost. Speed run. <laughs> We're okay. Don't worry, folks. I'm fine. <laughs> now, Beth got ignored the fire that's very close to her face. Um. Oh, and the, and the noise was just Chandler. Oh, that's a relief. So that settles it. Things are good and safe and boring. But wait. What if Chandler was the queen of bug snacks? Oh, please. That brute doesn't have the grace required for royalty. Yeah. If anybody's queen around here, it's me. Burn! You know, the Desert Burn Grumps the had a history of matriarchal leadership. Burn. What a fascinating system they had. Every year, the ladies would go hunting, and the one to bring home the biggest bug snack was the new head honcho. Oh. Big boy bug snakes. Let's go see what butter we have, and then we'll end the episode. <laughs> Grumpy baby mare. What? Hey yo. Hey yo. And I think there's something over here. Beth, what are you doing? Hi. Hi. What is it? Don't do that. <laughs> don't, don't do that. Don't. Don't do that. <laughs> I just want to see what this is. 
Seems like Philbo collects these beanbag dolls. It's a whole frog! And now I have one that's literally just called Mayu! Hey there! You look like you've seen some shit. Sometimes I wake up at night and I see something out there. Like a shadow watching me from the tree line. I try calling out to it, but it disappears before I get a good look at it. Take care. Alright, have a nice night. I mean, yeah, Wiggle looks like Wiggle looks like she's on drugs. But did I film in this buddy? I did not! Okay, let me donate this money. Oh, yes I did! It was sitting on here! God damn it! Spuddy! Well, I used to have brothers. We got, uh... Sputter, and then... Sputterino. <laughs> Hi, Wambus! Hey! Actually, 